Hi everybody, this is Gotham from Cadence Design Systems. I'm the Product Marketing Director for PCIe IP. Uh, we're here at uh, DevCon, and we have uh, almost eight demonstrations for you here today. Four of them are with our partners. Um, so we are very excited to show our, a, a working demonstration of our PCIe Gen 7 IP, both electrical and optical uh, interfaces working together in a multi-lane configuration. Modern data centers have uh, ever-increasing connectivity demands, where basically we have uh, demands for higher reaches, higher throughput, uh, with lower latencies, all without exp the expense of greater power. And in such a context, uh, you know, optical communications is a viable path forward. Uh, what we'll have there is optical fibers have excellent uh, dispersive qualities and they're really good waveguides. And so in this context, uh, if you particularly have front panel optics where the optical module is connected to the front panel of a card, uh, we have the benefits of ease of deployment as well as serviceability, as well as a wide uh, vendor ecosystem for the optical modules that we can leverage. And in this context, if we particularly have linear package optics, where we eliminate the additional retimer in the path, it allows us to further lower cost, uh, as well as power in the overall uh, in the link, as long as you can demonstrate a good enough link quality. And so what we're describing in this setup here is exactly such a scenario where we leverage Cadence's 100 and 28 gigabit per second DSP-based surdies to directly drive the optics, uh, linear optics, uh, from LuxShare. And I'll have my colleague Rajiv Jain describe this in a little bit more detail next. Let us focus on the Cadence demonstration of PCI Gen 7 Serial Link. At the Cadence setup, Serial Link demonstration, we have Cadence Phi transmitter connected to the OSFP MCB, which is connected to the LPO, LPO from Luxshare which is 800 gig DR8. On the optical side, we have a serial link connected from the transmit to receive in the loopback, the single mode fiber. The PRBS pattern, PRBS 31 pattern is generated by Cadence uh, Gen 7 Phi transmitter, transmitting it to the LPO, and in the LPO, linear driver is driving the data back to the TIA at the LPO receiver, the electrical output from the LPO is sent back to the Cadence Phi RX. As you can see on the screen, we are able to achieve prefac BER of 5E minus 8. We also have the Cadence receiver I shown at the display with the histograms showing the receiver health. So we have the transmitter from the PCIe Gen 7 transmitter connected to the Tektronic scope showing the open eye on the picture there. Let us see the PCIe Gen 7 Phi optical link demo setup. PCIe Gen 7 Phi transmitter and the receiver are connected to MCB with the MXPM connector cable. The optical link is formed with the Luxshare OSFP 800G DR8 LPO. The optical link is looped back with a single mode fiber. The POM4 data pattern PIBS 31Q at 128 gig gigabits per second is transmitted from Cadence Transmit PRBS generator to the LPO. The data traffic from the linear driver is optically looped back to the LPO receiver TIA. The electrical data output from LPO is received back to Cadence 5 receiver. Thanks for watching and for more information uh, visit cadence.com.